Yep. So let's just kind of keep your chin and chest up and come on down. Good. All right, let's actually do it from the side because that'll be easier for you to see the angles. So if uh, we got the back is bothering you by doing slow control deadlifts, let's keep the knees a little straighter right now just so we're really working the lower back. Good. So we're basically keeping the knees slightly bent. We're going to bring the arms straight down towards the toes while keeping the chest and eyes on the horizon. That'll maintain that proper arch in your back. And then when you're coming up from this lower position, you can squeeze the butt too to really reinforce that lower back. So this will be a great exercise for low back re-engagement or waking up those lower back muscles. And we have equal pressure on each foot. So this is a, very, this is a variation where we have soft knees with not a lot of knee bend. Now we can, as you progress, you can bend the knees more, deeper positions, hold weights in your hands, go into traditional deadlifts, Olympic style deadlifts, Romanian deadlifts, would all be progressions from this, this one. Now, what we like to do here too is kind of make it a little uh, more interesting. Let's lift the heels also. So now we're working on a little balance. This is really gonna wake up a lot of the muscles in your lower body and pretty much everything in your body is gonna wake up to keep you balanced. And anytime you're in a balance intensive environment, your core is gonna engage a lot more too to stabilize the spine at a greater level. Good, let's do about three more. Three. Good. Two. And last one. Good, so we have uh, the calf raise deadlift.